Hello everybody, back in Saul here for another episode of Spyro the Dragon. And last time we beat Cliff Town and Ice Cavern. So today, let's see what we have left to do. Okay, we have two levels I believe, the Flight Level and Dr. Shemp. So let's go into the Flight Level, why don't we? Night Flight. It rhymes and everything. Okay. 2400. Nope. Oh, okay. Guess we gotta get these rings first. So I don't remember what's in. Oh, this one's got lighthouses in it. Okay. So we got rings. We got treasure chests. We got. Uh, lighthouses that I just saw there, and I don't remember what else. The boats, maybe? Oh no, it's got uh, those arches. This one might be easier though, just because the one in the artisan world you're not supposed to find until later on, so it does have a little uh, steep difficulty curve if you play it right at the beginning of the game. But uh, should be this one should be all right. Uh, this music is really loud for whatever reason. Uh, okay. Let's light these lighthouses. Uh, where are all these lighthouses? We need four more lighthouses. Okay. And where's the last one? Oh, it's down here. Yeah! Alright, so that one wasn't too bad. Next to continue. And I don't want to try again, no thanks. We did get all the treasure in that one, I think. Well, if we completed it. Yeah, we did. So then, the last level we gotta do here is Dr. Shemp. Uh, cause there's nothing on this side, I don't think. Aside from the, uh,. Just the extra places where you can get gems. There was the, the thief guy over here. But as far as realms go, uh, Dr. Shemp is next. Confronting Dr. Shemp. Alright. Ooh, that music. That bass line, man. You guys might not be able to hear it because I do turn down the game sounds in editing, but uh, this bass line is really good. Look up the song. Uh, I mean, if you're, you're watching this video, you're on YouTube anyway. Wear some headphones, listen to this music. Good stuff. Okay. And, oh man, what? Where'd that other guy go? I think they just leave gems for you if they pass you, or if they fall off this edge. Uh, anyway. Alright. Whoa. Hey. Whoa. There we go. Camera, please. Okay. So these guys just leave gems here? Okay. Come here, I'd like to have a word with you. Thank you. Uh, there's stuff back here, I know. Hey. Uh, is that it? There's gems back here. Okay. Let's go up. This really? Oh, we, okay. We can glide all the way over there from here. Okay. I thought that just went nowhere. I was a little confused. I thought it was like to glide over here, and I thought to myself, why would they make such a high platform to get here? But <laughs> there was that other platform way out there that I'd forgotten about. Okay. Oh, so there we see Dr. Shemp up there. Hey, guy. Rondo. This guy 
guy thinks he's so cool. You don't know what it's been like listening to him over and over. But I'll tell you one thing. He should watch his back. Uh-huh. Oh, where am I? Oh, okay. So, what we gotta do here... Hill. Is flame his back, like the dragon said. He needs to watch his back. Okay, and he'll drop treasure every time we hit him. And he'll change his tactics. Oops. Ow. Get wrecked. All right. Uh, two hits and I'm dead. But, ooh, and that'll be the first death of a let's play here. Hey, please. What? Yeah, I get wrecked. Oh no, I don't have sparks, so now I gotta pick up the gems myself. And picking up these gems by yourself is a feat in itself. Alright. So that should be everything. I think we do have to kill a few enemies though, still. Uh, come on. Whoa. Okay. Let's go down here. Get this treasure out of the safe. And oh no. Oh, barely made that one. I thought I was gonna fall there. Uh, yep, so there's an enemy over here. Okay, and we're five gems short. Where are there five gems? Or a blue gem? Oh, was it left behind by one of the guys that fell? Yeah, here it is. Alright. So that should be all. Let's go to the end of the level, back to the Homeworld portal. Hey. Okay. Let's go home, Spyro. Oh yeah. Three thousand. All right. And that does it for. Peacekeeper's World, I believe. Yep. I'm gonna have to go get Sparks back, so let's go kill some Jackrabbit dudes. There we go. Screw you, guy. Hey, come here. There we go. Sparks just happens to appear again as soon as you kill the first fodder there. Uh, okay. But, uh, okay, so that's everything. So let's go to the balloonist. Cosnold, the balloonist. Can't believe how fast you found so much stolen treasure. Hop aboard for the Magic Crafters world if you are ready. All right, so let's go to Magic Crafters. Entering Magic Crafters world. Alrighty. I like this music too. This game is just full of good music. Okay. Hey guy. Give me that egg. Oh no, and then he jumps up on this ledge up here where you can't get him. Hey guy. So these are the Norks in this level, or in this world there. Uh, bird looking magician things. <laughs> Okay, let's get all this treasure, and then we'll free this dragon here. Cosmos. Welcome to Magic Crafters. I want you to release the dragons, reclaim our treasure, and recover the eggs from those pesky blue thieves. Whatever you say, guy. Okay. 
Is the thief over here reset? He is. Get wrecked, guy. I don't remember how many eggs are in the game total. Might be like 12 or something. Okay. So then over here we have more of these uh, wizard guys. And they'll, they'll move the ground and make platforms. Okay. Create a wall so you can't get past there. Screw you, guy. Okay. And, yep, the wall goes back up. We gotta go around for that one. <gasps> no! Oh! His thing picked me up and it almost threw me in the water there. These are some of the most annoying enemies in the game. Get wrecked. Okay. I do like the, the portals in this world. But, uh, right now all we're going to do is concentrate on this home world here. Trying to get everything here. Uh, that actually might take up the rest of this episode's time. Uh, but, uh, whatever. Hey. And if you try to cut across for this guy, he changes direction. So annoying. This is one of the most annoying thieves to get in the game. Uh, whatever. Give me treasure. You have to find ways to cut across, but not cut across too much or else he'll... He'll uh, change direction. Come on, guy. There we go, finally. That took a while. I'll probably just cut that. <laughs> okay. Uh, IS down here. Screw you, guy. Alright. So here we have the first instance of Choop Supercharge in this game. Xantor, tell us about it. When you see arrows like these, you can charge along with them to begin a supercharge. Supercharge? Excellent. Go ahead. Try it. Oh, I will. Is there treasure up here first, though? There is. Alright. Supercharge is this. Because or else this guy puts a wall up and you can't get past there. Okay, so I think that's everything in this part of the world. Let's go over here. Hey. Whoa, no! Please. Okay. Camera, please. And this guy will shoot you with lightning. And that's not nice. So there we see the next balloonist way off in the distance. Ooh, that's a creepy noise. Okay. So there's that. Gotta go back here. And there's a key. Or a safe. Uh, there was a safe down here, which I think we broke with our supercharge, maybe. So, oh, I guess we picked up those gems already, though. Uh, okay, let's go kill these bird wizard dudes. Go. Oh no! Oh, I totally could have gotten that. All right, here's the next flight, crystal flight. Which we'll save for the end again. <laughs> okay. Who's this? Boldar. This portal leads to a special place where you can learn to fly. I remember when I was a young dragon earning my wings. Learn to fly. Got it. Jeez, Spyro. Come on, Spyro, you gotta listen to the old people's stories. To tell some of the best stories. I know, at least my grandma does. Uh, uh, I think down here we just drop. Yeah. Oh, there's an actual way down here? Okay. Hey! Come on now. Screw you guy. Okay. Some light platforming there. Uh, 
Ooh. Okay. Jeez, that sparks animation for eating that butterfly takes forever. Okay, so there's the balloonist. I, I think if we talk to him, we actually have enough stuff to get to the next world already, but... And this is the boss level here. Blowhard. Uh... I believe we've gotten everything. No, we haven't. We need to find that safe. Uh, where is that safe? I don't remember. Uh, it's over here, maybe? Yeah, right in there. So, how do we get there? Well, my young friends. Young friends? I don't know how old you guys are. Well, I know how old some of you are because I know some of the people who are watching these videos. But, alright. Here we go. And... Safe. And that should be everything. Yep. That looks like ten gems to me. Yeah! We get all the dragons? We've got all the dragons. Good. Alright. So that does it for the Magic Crafters homeworld. Next time we'll come right here into Alpine Ridge and continue from there. But until then, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Bye bye!